your first alert forecast with meteorologist Chelsea Aaron. Yeah, Florida has been getting battered lately and they do have another severe weather threat right on the hills as we head into tomorrow. Ongoing severe weather in portions of eastern Texas right now, just south of Dallas near the Austin area. Places uh, including in that is also going to be Waco. No severe weather for us. That system that we tracked leading to some showers early on today has continued to move to the east. We likely will be looking beautiful as we head into the rest of your evening, but more rain chances as we head into your weekend, unfortunately, but your day parts, they're going to be great. Current temperatures a bit cooler off to the west in the 60s with low and mid 70s off to the east. We will be dealing with a few breezes out of the west northwest throughout the next couple of hours, but winds will calm down likely after sunset. I put a big spring behind your eight hour forecast in case you're headed out to Panoply looking great this evening. Few clouds out there, but really nothing to worry about. Temperatures will stay rather mild through the evening with 60s likely by eight o'clock as we head over Overnight overnight lows will likely be in the low in mid 50s rain on the roof forecasts more rain chances for your Saturday and Sunday, but I will say this graphic doesn't really tell the full story. We're not going to see rain until late in the day on Saturday and most if not all of that rain will be out of here by the time you wake up on Sunday, so it's going to be during the sleeping hours mainly waking up to mostly clear skies as we head out tomorrow low in mid 50s. We will see more pops of sunshine throughout the day, which is going to help warm us up all the way near 80 degrees if you can believe it. A few showers across northwest Alabama by around 4 o'clock, but still mostly dry. That big chance of rain, that's not going to come until likely 8, 9 o'clock, and we will be tracking very heavy rain at times, but again, no severe weather is expected. Maybe some gusty winds, but that's about it. Showers, even a few embedded thunderstorms will continue late tomorrow evening, overnight into the early morning hours of your Sunday, but look at this, Sunday, 7 o'clock in the morning, all of this is going to push out to the east. Temperatures will be cooler and winds will be breezy behind this system on Sunday with afternoon highs likely only in the upper 60s, low 70s. And if you plan on getting some yard work done, I would wait a couple days. Here are some of those future rainfall totals, especially along and east of I-65. Places could pick up up to two inches or possibly even three inches in localized areas. But again, we will dry out and we will stay dry for a good period as we head into your next work and school week. Look at that big stretch Monday through Thursday. No rain chance at all. Trash pandas, they're going to have some pretty good games coming up. We won't be tracking rain until Friday in the forecast, and by then, temperatures will steadily start to creep back near average in the upper 70s.